Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Golden Sun. The last part we took care of the Alton Mines and now we're over here at Llama Temple. Yeah, so let's um, head up. Did you know the Master Hama is the greatest master of Chi? Um, no. Then today you shall see the Master Hama is truly the master of Chi. Okay. Master Hama is meditating. Please be extremely quiet. So, Isaac, you and your adept companions have finally come. Finally come? Was she expecting us? Well, looks like it. But how did she know we'd be here now? I had anticipated your arrival. You knew you were coming then? Yep, I guess so. I have been here a long... I've been waiting a while for you. I don't care. <laughs> you come seeking the elemental stars? You know about the elemental stars too? Who... who are you? I'm a Jupiter adept, just like Ivan. I'm not a Jupiter addict. What are you talking about? You make your soda. It's me drinking soda. You are Ivan, although you may not know, may not yet know it. Why do you say that? Do you not have the power to read minds? This ability is unique to the Jupiter addicts. Well. You predicted our coming? Is that also synergy? Ho oh, ho, excellent question, Miss Mia. Yes, the ability to, for to foresee events also belongs to the Jupiter Adepts. Then can I even learn the power of prediction too? He already has. I don't think I have. You do. You merely do not yet know what, that you have it. You merely do not yet know that you have it. Oh, power of Jupiter must be great if it lets you see the future. Oh, but I think I'm going to use an even greater power. What greater power? Reveal. Reveal. Yes, I have waited long to pass the power of true sight onto you. You waited here in Mama Temple just to teach Reveal to Ivan? You will need Reveal if you are going to achieve your goals. Jupiter adapts could learn Reveal on their own over time. But that power alone will not help you find Satros as his company moves on. It was Satros and his companions who blocked Silk Road. Felix and the rest of them, huh? Those cowards. Felix bears a terrible fate, a burden I would not wish on any man. A terrible fate? What do you mean? I am sorry, but I can say nothing more of this matter. Now we must focus on the power of Reveal. You will need the power of Reveal to cross the evil Lamekin Desert. An evil desert? Is that even possible? You know what, at this point I'm really not... Um, I wouldn't question it. You believe that, Isaac? Well, I just don't buy it. Why would we need Reveal to cross the desert? Crossing Lamekin Desert was hard enough with the extreme heat. But evil has taken hold of the desert, and its heat has become unbearable. Entering the desert now is nothing short of asking for death. Then how could Satros cross such a deadly place? Satros Minardi are Mars adepts. I'm merely guessing. But their powers might help them suppress the heat as they cross. 
still don't understand. How will Reveal help us in such an evil place? Reveal will help you find oasis to cool you against the heat. Why would we need Reveal for that? Won't we be able to see the oasis? Again, I apologize if you hear a dog barking. Do you know what a mirage is? Uh, yeah. The desert is filled with mirages that prevent you from seeing clearly. Without Reveal, you cannot find the oasis. Sounds like we should have Ivan the Reveal, don't you think? Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to die in any evil desert. Ivan, you should let Master Hama teach you how to use Reveal. What's wrong, Master Hama? You could pass Reveal on to me, can't you? I am unsure that it will work. In preparation for this day, I tried to pass the power on to a young girl, although the power was not revealed. My student was not an adept. But I thought anyone could hone a skill he or she already possessed. However, I saw no change in the girl. No, there was a change. Feiji, why are you here? I sensed it. Sensed it? What did you sense? Isu is in great danger. I, I can't pronounce that. <laughs> Isu left this place a long time ago. I know, but Hisu did not return to Xi'an. The boulders in the mountains. I sensed it. I came through the mine. I came to ask for help. I sensed nothing as I was focused on Isaac's arrival. But why has the power come to you now after all this time? Gems fell from the sky. One hit me right on the head. Gems. Synergy stones. Then this may work after all. What about Hisu? Let us hurry to Hisu's aid. Oh, uh, wait a minute, what? Master Hama, what about us? What about Reveal? I'd completely forgotten. It seems I succeeded in passing my power to Feiji. You'll be fine. I even learned Reveal. This should do it. Use Reveal to cross the desert. But your Reveal may not be that strong yet. The Oasis may not appear. The rest is up to Ivan's abilities. Ivan, I'm very glad to see you have grown to be such a strong man. Wait, what? What do you mean by that? Did they know each other? Ivan, do you and Master Hama know each other? Oh, oh, there you go. Game. No, but she doesn't feel like a stranger. Felix and the others must be far ahead of us by now. Yeah. Then we better get moving. Let's go. We can't just leave like this. Hema might need our help. She only has Phase E to assist her. Shouldn't we help too? Yeah, she's right. I'm more worried about Felix and the others, but I'm not opposed to rescuing Hisu. We'll go with you, Isaac, whatever you decide. I wonder what Master Hama was talking about. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's go. Right, so let's um check this real quick. Alright, so we have reveal now, so let's set that to... Um, one more. Let me figure this out. Ah. Okay. Oh, I'm, I'm stupid. Whatever. Let's go over here. He who has the power to see that which cannot be seen shall see the truth. 
also reads the writing on the wall. Huh. Alright, let's try this. Reveal. Oh, and it's a treasure chest. And everything is in black and white all of a sudden. Huh. So yeah, that's what it does. It reveals items and well, it makes everything black and white. But that's really not the point. So, alternatively, I could just move along. But I'm gonna go help those people out. Oh, that must be his Sue or whatever how it's supposed to be pronounced. Oh, look right here, and cave. Okay, so let's, um, real quick. His Sue, are you okay? Oh gosh, he's so fat. Oh no. And he's got the... Mo Howard hairdo. Oh no. That's a Sue. Okay. Master Hama, I am okay, but the boulder, I cannot move. The Sue seems unhurt. You must be glad, Fiji. Yes, thank you, Master. But how can we free him? I don't know what we can do. Be strong, Hisu, we will help you. Alright, let's uh, use some of our skills. Isaac, did you lift the boulder? Oh my, the boulder! It floats! Quickly, Feiji, we must hold Hisu free. Ready yourself, Hisu, I'm going to pull. One, two, three. Hisu is halfway out, just a little further. Can you hang on just a moment longer, Isaac? Well, um, yeah, yeah, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Isaac. Ready? I'm going to pull. One, two, three. I mean, I think I'll just kind of stay here all day, but okay. You did it, Master Hama. Hisu is free. You did it, Feiji. Thank you, Isaac. You must contact Master Fen and ask him to tend to Hisu's injuries. I will ask him to clean- I will ask him to clean up the rocks, too. Excellent. If Silk Road remains blocked, everyone will suffer. <clears> Hadap, <throat> let me thank you again. I am truly grateful. I did not expect you to come and aid us. You know, Master Hadap, we are the ones who should be grateful. Thank you for passing the power of Revere out to me. For what you said. What is it, Ivan? <laughs> Nothing. Well, really, I was the one who suggested we help you, right? You know. No, Gary, you want us to get moving. Isaac, me, I don't make me look like such a fool. <laughs> do not worry, Garrett. I do not mind. Travel well, my friends. I hope to see you soon. Weren't you going to ask Master Hama what she meant earlier? We did not know when we will be able to see Master Hama again. Hama, whatever. <clears throat> Isaac, don't you think we should ask Master Hama what she meant? Uh, no. Well, you think we should just leave it as it is? Thank you, everyone. But it is better that we leave now. What do you mean? Master Hama hasn't looked me in the eye since she said those words. Well, that just makes me even more curious. Don't worry about it. I doubt she would have even tell me. I doubt she would even tell me if I asked. He does have a point. Well, that's just... Master Hamba will tell me when we have completed our mission. I have to believe in that. Okay, well, that happened. Right, well, on that note, um... I think that's as much as I'm gonna do this episode, so... Uh... I thank you all for watching. Um, I'm just gonna go out of here real quick. So, the next part, we're going to be tackling the Lamarckan Desert, so, see you then! Mm -hmm.
Operation Sunrise is a petition to try and get uh, Camelot, the creators of Golden Sun, to make a fourth title in the series. We had to wait seven years between the second and third games, and while the third game was a, you know, very appreciated, it was not the best one. However, they left with a cliffhanger, and as anyone who has ever run into a cliffhanger, you don't like cliffhangers. So basically what I'm trying to petition for is the base what we're trying to petition for is for a fourth game. And Camelot said that if uh, we ask for it, they will deliver. So please uh, support Operation Sunrise and uh, thank you all for watching. And you can find the link to the petition in the description. Alright, have a good day.